Oh, tonight's low down to 32, mostly clear. Areas of frost, I would say widespread and killing frost freeze conditions, but there will be a little bit of wind northwest out of the northeast at 5 to 10, stirring things up a bit, but still take in those uh, sensitive plants and uh, cover things up if you can. Future Track HD as we head through your Friday, kind of a mix of sun and clouds out there, and there could be a sprinkle or flurry. Our model doesn't really show anything, but it's not out of the question. Wouldn't see any accumulation with a high of 46. It's going to be breezy tomorrow as well. North northwest winds at 15 to 20 with higher gusts, so it's going to feel more like the 30s uh, even during the middle of the afternoon tomorrow. Maybe a flake uh, before sunrise passing by Saturday morning. Otherwise, Saturday afternoon looks cool and still a little bit on the breezy side with partly cloudy skies. Looking ahead at Sunday, I talked about the rain coming our way, and this is a look at rainfall forecast totals Sunday afternoon into very early Monday morning, right around a quarter of an inch or so. So not uh, a widespread soaking rain, but uh, an impact uh, type of rain and that you'll probably want to keep the umbrellas handy for Sunday into Sunday night. So once again, uh, kind of a soft freeze, if you will, tonight or frost and then a hard freeze uh, tomorrow night down to 28 degrees. And uh, that's the forecast low for Grand Rapids. Of course, the outlying areas uh, could get down into the mid 20s, 49 for uh, high on Saturday and breezy. And then that wet second half of the weekend next week, though, looks dry from uh, from uh, make that Monday through Wednesday. Wednesday, we could hit 60, still a bit below average, but we'll take it because on Thursday it looks uh, cool and damp again with highs in the upper 50s.